hate crime. It's not something we really think about every day, but for some people, it's happening and at an increasing rate. Over the past three years, hate crime has gone up and up. Police are recording more hate crimes, especially race hate crimes, than ever before. The most recent statistics show an average 18% increase in all recorded hate crimes. It's clear that this is a problem that isn't going away. We need to act now. But what exactly is hate crime? Hate crime is defined as crimes committed against a person because of their disability, gender identity, race, religion or belief, or sexual orientation. So that means hate crime isn't just against one group of people. Many people can be affected, and in different ways. Hate crime can take forms like violence and assault, verbal abuse, destroying property or belongings, and bullying, threats, and harassment. Hate crime is on the rise, which means it's more important than ever to report it. If you've been a victim of hate crime, there are a number of different ways it can be reported. You can go directly to the police, calling 999 in an emergency, or 101 in a non-emergency. There's also the option of visiting your local police station. You can also report online through reportit.org. This form gets sent to the local police station to be looked into. If you don't feel comfortable reporting the matter at a police station, you can use a third-party hate crime reporting centre. There's 200 across the West Midlands, with staff who have been trained to assist and support victims or witnesses submitting the report. Still not sure where to turn for help? There are a number of advice services that can help you deal with being a victim of hate crime. The Citizens Advice Bureau, Stop Hate UK and Victim Support can all help you. They can help you get the support you need and advice on how to report a crime. These services are confidential and free sources of advice to you. Respect difference. Say no to hate crime.